Hi everyone. It's so good to be here with you today. I'm Steph J, eBay's Chief Business and Strategy Officer. And I'm gonna spend some time today talking about our buyers. More specifically, our best and most valuable group, who we call enthusiast buyers. So, as you may know, eBay has 138 million buyers around the globe. These buyers are collectors, hobbyists, category fanatics, they are looking for things like trading cards, sneakers, handbags, car parts, unique things that bring them a lot of joy. In fact, I recently met a great young seller, Lauren. She's also a very passionate eBay buyer. Lauren's a major collector of antique glass bowls, a particular kind that I learned about called hen on nests. She's so passionate about her collection, she has a TikTok account dedicated fully to her unique bowls. It's very cool to see how eBay is such a big part of her life. As a buyer, she's sourcing hard to find pieces for her collection. And as a seller, she's selling all kinds of things and she knows that through our platform, she has immediate access to millions of buyers globally. So let me share a little bit more about these buyers and their shopping habits. Of our 138 million buyers, a good portion of them are what we call enthusiasts. These enthusiast buyers drive the, ma the vast majority of our GMV, approximately 70%. They spend nine times more than the average non-enthusiast buyer. And on average, they also shop 30 different days per year, spend $3,000 per year, and they increase their spend and purchase days by 50% after their first year on eBay. As you can see, that's a really active group of buyers. It's one of the things that has impressed me the most about eBay, how passionate our customers are about their collections, about the things they love, and how eBay is such a consistent part of their lives. I know for me personally, I've always been able to find what I need on eBay. A few years ago, my son wanted to be a race car driver for Halloween. There was only one place where I could find an authentic, toddler-sized Ferrari jacket. He still wears it all the time, even though it's too small now. And of course, he's been asking for more Ferrari items all the time. But whether it's my son or the countless trading cards fanatics that I've met over the past year, the energy that they have around the things that they treasure is really contagious. I've been thinking a lot about what I should be collecting myself these days. Okay, so you might be thinking, wow, these enthusiast buyers sound great, but how do I get their business? Well, it's important to understand their profiles a little bit more. At eBay, we've identified four main types of enthusiast buyers. First, sourcing pros. They leverage eBay for their commercial activity, and they usually purchase within one theme, like a garage owner who purchases parts and accessories. Next, category-centric buyers. These customers are also concentrated on one theme, but it's for themselves. They're hobbyists or collectors like Lauren and her antique bowls. Our third group is value seekers. These folks are always on the lookout for great deals and discounted prices, mostly in electronics and fashion. My husband is definitely in this group. And finally, horizontal buyers. They leverage eBay across all of our categories but aren't as price sensitive as value seekers. I'm always buying a ton of stuff for my family and my kids. Halloween costumes, of course, kids gear, sports gear, kitchen items, and so I definitely fit in this horizontal profile most days. So these are the four main enthusiast buyer categories, but let me dive even deeper into the two groups that drive the most growth, category-centric buyers and value seekers. I think helping you understand these two groups of buyers and what they're looking for will help you grow your business. This will help you adapt your offerings and tools like product breadth, price, promotion, direct communications. I'd like to introduce you to one of our category-centric buyers, Nick. Nick is a sports memorabilia enthusiast. As I've mentioned, buyers like Nick usually purchase one around one theme 
like collectibles or hobbies. In Nick's case, he is a huge Boston Celtics fan. In particular, five-time NBA MVP, Bill Russell. Last year, Nick spent $2,300 on eBay, and 65% of his spend was in this category, sports memorabilia. He purchased a few autographed photos and a basketball, of course, signed by Bill Russell. He also bought Boston Celtics bobbleheads, three books, and a comic book featuring Bill Russell. I didn't even know those existed. As you can see, he's a huge fan. And I think it's so cool to see that our buyers can find items of meaning across so many categories, all in one place. I know we spend a lot of time talking about eBay's focus categories. It's for a good reason. Why? Because when we deliver a great experience for an enthusiast, they buy in other categories as well. And this is a benefit to all of our sellers. For example, Nick here, he spent more than $800 outside of the sports memorabilia category just last year. The breadth and depth of our inventory makes sure that the Knicks of the world keep coming back. This is foundational to building loyalty and repeat buying. Nick started shopping on eBay 18 years ago. And did you know that the average enthusiast buyer has been with us for about 12 years? It's really incredible how loyal these buyers are. We're building on this loyal base and attracting enthusiast buyers by consistently delivering trusted experiences. As your partner, eBay will also help you build trust and loyalty by providing you with the tools that make using eBay seamless. All right, as I mentioned, value seekers also drive incredible growth. They come to eBay looking for items at the right price. The next buyer I wanna introduce you to is Phil. Phil is a value seeker and he spent $2,000 on eBay purchases across many, many categories. Fashion, home, beauty, electronics, he covers it all. Phil's super engaged with eBay. He bought 93, 93 items just last year. Pens, a fridge magnet, a cell phone case, a car charger, a smart vacuum cleaner, even sheets and hand soap. This is a buyer who goes to eBay first for almost everything that they need. Value seekers know what they're looking for. Items that are unique or maybe even everyday items. And they know how to navigate our platform to find value across every category. Some of Phil's purchases, like his 80 vintage vinyls, were pre-loved. Some of them had free shipping, and some of them might have been purchased because of a seller offer. Phil and value seekers like him have done their research and they love a good find or a good deal. Time and time again, they come back to eBay for the breadth and scale of inventory at competitive prices. So how does this all help you engage repeat buyers? It's through the tools we're building. Whether your customers are value seekers, category-centric buyers, horizontal buyers, or sourcing pros, we're helping you turn them into repeat buyers with tools that enable more visibility and velocity. One example is this, it's a feature called Save This Seller. This suggestion is prompted when a buyer makes a purchase. After they check out, they can opt to save you as a seller. This may seem simple, but this prompt has quadrupled the number of saved sellers to date. And most importantly, we're seeing it lead to more purchase frequency. Over the next couple of days, you'll hear more about how to use some of these tools including making offers or using coupons. This way you can increase your audience. A little later today, you'll be hearing from Andrea about how eBay is attracting new buyers. And tomorrow, Ashish is gonna to talk to you about the tools that you can use for engagement. Some key takeaways for today and learnings from watching our enthusiast buyers over the years though. Engagement and loyalty are critical to cultivating relationships with these buyers. And we're working to make that even easier for you than ever to create these connections through many tools. We've updated our stores experience, and now you all can present offers directly to loyal buyers. We've also enhanced our direct to customer communications with newsletters and coupons. And lastly, we will 
have even more tools to simplify your selling experience, including updates to payments to make international selling even more seamless. By understanding our enthusiast buyers and the tools that help you target this group, you can build your audience of relevant, highly engaged buyers and then turn them into very loyal customers. So let me leave you with this. I've been at eBay for a little over a year now. And what's had the biggest impact on me is truly how passionate our customers are. Spending time with both buyers and sellers is one of the most energizing parts of my days and my job. To see people's faces light up when they talk about Harry Potter, Funko Pop collections, or the vintage motorcycle that they're fixing and can only fix because of the parts that they found on eBay. I've learned more about trading cards in the last year than I ever thought I could. And it reminds me of why we do what we do. The passion, the drive, and the magic that happens through our platform is really super special. I'm sure you feel it too. Thank you so much for spending this time with me today.